uh, we're exploring uh, the possibility of doing a, a spec series. This is something that's pretty typical at the end of the life of, of a supercar is to kind of turn it into a race car. Um, and the, the ACR is really a, a race car, a thinly veiled race car, you know, so, yeah. so we're just um, looking at what if we were to sell a version that had a built-in roll cage, a racing seat, basically a turnkey track special. Right and and a lot of our one. owners basically right take ACRs that. already and turn them into race cars, so we're going to you know, kind of uh, save them the, the, the headache, so to speak, and do it for them. And then we're also going to support it um, and see what we can do about supporting a series with the VRL, the Viper Racing League, which is a very well-established training ground uh, to help owners really know how to, to get the best out of their vehicles. So, so this is going to be a vehicle that customers can buy? Yeah, they can buy and enjoy and then uh, really, hopefully, they'll, they'll be uh, making records and, and uh, creating legends for us. Sure. Any estimate yet on when it might go into production? Uh, well, uh, it'll be made in the spring of 2000. When we were developing the ACRX, we uh, had definitely had the racer in mind, and we started with safety. Uh, the roll cage is uh, built to a high level of strength. Uh, so it's similar to the construction of the competition coupe, um, because obviously the, the professional racer and the grassroots racer needs, needs the safety equipment. Um, but you'll notice we didn't just stop with safety. We amped up the incredible performance of the production, the street legal Viper ACR. And if you look at the front of the car, we added a couple of uh, extra dive planes to the front end, which add another 100 pounds of downforce to uh, the already massive uh, downforce numbers that the uh, ECR produces. Um, we've been working with a uh, couple different tires. We haven't selected one yet. Um, we're looking at a, a true racing slick and also possibly a DOT racing slick. Um, the decision hasn't been finalized yet. And of course, we couldn't leave the motor alone. Uh, we had to increase the performance there as well. And um, we've been able to, with relatively minor uh, adjustments to the motor, get 640 horsepower out of it. And this package is going to be an incredible uh, machine for the racer. It's a thrill to drive at the track, an incredible handling machine. And we think any, any pro or, or, uh, or grassroots um, enthusiast is going to love this ACRX.